here we have problem three. I will go ahead and set up this diagram on a um, coordinate plane using the center as zero, zero. We know that the diameter is 70, so that the radius is 35. We know that the ball exits the green at the rightmost edge, which is gonna be 35, zero. And then we know that it enters here and that it starts at um, coordinates negative, negative 40 and um, negative 50. So first, what we, what we wanna do is find the equation for the line. I just used um, our point slope formula, so I did y minus y1 equals n times x minus x1 using the rise and the run as our slope, so 2 over 3, and we get um, y equals 2 thirds x minus 35. Um, we want to plug that now into our uh, equation for a circle in place of y to find out where, they, um, where the line and the circle intersect. We should get two values since it intersects at two points. Um, you get x squared plus 2 thirds x minus 35 squared equals uh, r squared, or 1,225. You foil it out, and then after foiling, you should get 13x squared minus 420x equals 0. Then you use, want to use the quadratic formula to solve for x. Uh, you can see my work here, and then your two x values are going to be um, 0 and 420 over 13. Then once we get those, we can plug it into our equation for a circle, solve for y, and get um, y equals 13.48 at coordinate 420 over um, 13 for x, or 32.3. So the problem is the question is asking um, where it enters. So you can see that the, so this triangle that I drew um, enters at these coordinates, which I should mention, which I just mentioned. Um, and then what we want to do is find the um, the distance because now it asks how long it will take to get there. So I just drew a little triangle with 7.69 on the bottom, 36.52 on the right. This is based off of the coordinates we just found. Solve for C which will get um, the distance that the ball will travel before entering the green. And then we want to um, use the rate at 10 feet per second to find out how long it takes to get there. It's gonna be 3.732 seconds. Next question asks, how long does the ball spend inside of the green? So now we need to set up another question where we find out where the point intersects um, originally where the second point intersects and then find the hypotenuse between the two and um, I just leave Pythagorean theorem knowing that the ball leaves the green um, or it's gonna be in the green for 98.62 feet and um, at 10 feet per second it's 9.862 seconds Sorry, what I meant to say is that this point is 9.862 seconds away from its original, um, its original point, and then we do 9.862 seconds minus where it originally entered the green, and we get 6.15 seconds um, inside the green. The next part of the question asks, where is the ball located when it is closest to the cup, and when does this occur? So in order for to solve this problem, we have to know that the, um, the what I call the CPA, or the closest point of approach, is gonna be perpendicular to that line where um, the perpendicular line intersects with the cup, in this case, 0 0.00. 0. So I created a um, formula for the perpendicular line using um, our rule of perpendicularity, or setting um, one slope times the slope of the other equal to one. Um, in this case, it's easy. We can just do um, our slope of two thirds, um, flip it and make it negative. And then we know that the intercept is gonna be zero. So we get negative three half x plus zero, set it to our original equation oh no. and solve for x and we get 140 over 13. And then plug x into our um, equation for um, 
one of the lines, and then we should get y equals negative 3 over 2 times 140 over 13. That's going to be equal to negative 210 13. So that's the coordinate at which it will be closest to the top. The next question is when, at what point, will it be closest to the top? So um, we just set up another triangle using 50.77 and 33.85 as the um, lengths of the cup, being that 50 minus the absolute value of y is going to be this length, and 40 plus the absolute value of x is going to be the length of this based off of our picture. And then we go ahead and plug it in, and we get um, the point being 61.02 seconds from its, or feet from its original point. And at 10 feet per second, it's 6.102 seconds. Um, the ball will be close to that.